All right, so in this video, it's a, again another pretty simple one. I just um, don't know if everybody knows about how to do this editing. So in Word Power Basic 60, that's where I am. Um, I'm going to create a sentence. I'm going to show you how to edit um, using the scrolling arrows. So I. I. Um, eat. eat. Uh, gee, I eat crackers. Crackers. And then I'm gonna put a I eat crackers. And then um, I'm gonna do another sentence. I so I drink drink juice juice. And then I drink juice. So right now it says if you tap the sentence bar. I eat crackers. I drink juice. Okay. So let's say I wanted to edit that without having to like delete, go back and delete words that I still want in the sentence. You're going to go to the um, ABC123 and then you're going to come down to the bottom row and you see the it's green and it has those arrows. You're going to tap on that and then you can either move forward, which we wouldn't because we don't have anything in front of the cursor right now. See how the um, sentence strip is highlighted? So let's say I wanted to um go back a word so let's say i wanted to add oops i meant to put i drink orange juice not just i drink juice so you're going to tap word and it's going to go right in front of juice and then you can either go select um the icon of orange or you can type orange and space. Okay, I drink orange juice. Great. I drink crackers and I drink orange juice. Or I drink crackers, I drink orange juice. Okay. Let's say now that um, I want to go back to the first sentence um, to fix that. So I don't want to, instead of hitting word, 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 I can hit the arrow that says sentence and it will go back to right before the second sentence. Um, then I can backspace, oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. And then I'm gonna do, um, I eat crackers and cheese. And again, you can select this from the pictures, but I'm just typing, um, I eat crackers and cheese. I drink orange juice. Um, okay, so let's say I want to turn it to past tense, but I don't want to erase everything. I just want to edit the, the verbs. All right, I'm going to go word, 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 and then I'm going to backspace and put I ate space. And then if you go to the right, you can see you can scroll the other way. So I'm going to scroll. So I ate crackers and cheese. So now I want to go to the next sentence. So I'm going to scroll to the right sentence. I'm going to click that. And then I'm going to go, I want to go to drink. So I'm going to click the next word. And then I'm going to do word again. And I'm going to backspace and fix that to be past tense. I drank orange juice. So now it says, oops. I ate crackers and cheese. I drank orange juice. Nice. So the other way you can do that is, oh, and if you want to just, if you're done editing and you want to close out these um, arrows, you just hit close up there. And it'll give you back the shift button. And then the other, the plus sign and all that at the bottom. Um, the other way you can do that is some, I don't, you have to check your settings. So right now my settings doesn't allow me to, um, highlight the like uh, highlight the um, sentence strip when I hold on to it with my finger I mean it does it so what it does is that you can copy and share but let's say I don't want to use the arrows and I want to edit by just moving the cursor around with my finger in the sentence strip so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to menu and then I'm going to go to settings and I'm going to scroll down here um, and somewhere here it says allow, oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Allow, I just lost it. Allow place cursor. Um, and then I'm gonna hit done. 
So now when I take my finger and I and I press and hold it, it's going to not just have copy and share, it's also going to have place cursor. So I'm going to tap place cursor and now I can drag that cursor with uh sorry, now I can tap wherever I want to put the cursor. Um I'm going to double tap. I ate crackers and cheese. Oops, I wanted to I drank orange juice. I ate crackers and cheese. All right, so I'm I drank orange juice. Some cheese. Some cheese. Some cheese. Some cheese. Okay. Cheese. <laughs> cheese. There. I fixed it. So it's it. It it says it the way you spell it, and then you know when it's a pie that says cheese, you got the right the right answer. Um. So now I can just tap one. I ate crackers and some cheese. I drank orange juice. So that's how you can do it. So you can either use the cur the arrow buttons to edit. Um, um, again, you can go by character. You can just go back by word, or you can go back all the way to the sentence. You can go forward, character, go forward, word, go forward, um, sentences. Or you can make sure in your settings that you have the um, ability to um, use the cursor. Um, again, it's in settings and allow place cursor. So right there. Um, okay. That is just a little video on how to edit without what I used to do, which is if I forgot the word some in my first sentence and I already got to, I drink orange juice, I would go back and delete everything until I added some and then kept going forward, but we don't need to do that. All right. Thanks guys. I hope this helped. And, um, let me know, like, subscribe, um, follow, and let me know what else I can do. All right. Thanks.